This morning, local wildlife centers are calling on people to be careful when wrapping their trees with lanternfly tape. They have been receiving a lot of reports recently of small animals getting stuck in them. Fox 43's Pabio so joins us now in studio with more on what members of the community can do to prevent this from happening. Good morning, Paula. Good morning. Well, experts with the Raven Ridge Wildlife Center in Lancaster County say the success and survival rate is very low for animals like birds and bats that get stuck in lanternfly tape. It's that time of the year when homeowners are putting a special kind of tape around their trees to slow the invasion of spotted lanternflies. The insect species can be a big nuisance to local plants and crops. However, this is also the time when many animals like squirrels, bats, and hawks begin to have babies and need trees in order to learn how to survive on their own. So instead of the tape trapping lantern flies, it's trapping other animals. It's very, very sticky. Um, there's a toxin in this glue. Um, the stress of these animals being stuck and not able to get off of these sticky tape. Um, whether it be the animal or people panicking, trying to pull these animals off of the tape. Um, there's feathers lost, there's bones that are being broken, there's skin that's being torn. If one of these animals gets stuck in the tape, here's what you need to do. To put like tissues or paper towel around the sticky part that the animal is not sticking to, cut around it, put the animal in a box and transport uh, to a wildlife rehabilitator. And there are ways you can prevent this from happening. Circle traps, they have some different other ideas of traps that can get the nymphs and the lantern flies, uh, but are a deterrent to our wildlife. Also screen, very fine uh, window screen, which is easy to work with and to bend around the trunk of the tree. Uh, over the tape that if the animal does happen to fly in there, they can bounce off of that screen or they can crawl over it and continue to go up the tree and, and utilize it. We'll have a link to resources that can help you create a wildlife barrier for a spotted lanternfly sticky band trap. You'll be able to find all that information on our website, foxover3.com. Reporting in studio, Paula Veoso, Fox 43 News.